The Supreme Court's ruling to allow homeless camping bans has now paved the way for more cities to try and put them in place. And San Marcos could be the latest one to follow suit. ABC 10 News reporter Danny Miskell has the action their council wants to take at their meeting tonight to try and get a handle on a growing homeless problem. Locals here in San Marcos told me that they typically see homeless encampments in this general area next to Richmar Park. So I went inside this supermarket and I asked the employee and she verified that she sees unsheltered people coming and going around here all the time. Now we haven't seen any encampments as of Tuesday morning, but the city shared with us a staff report that lists multiple incidents, which is pushing the city towards this vote tonight to ban encampments. And they're saying one of the main challenges they are facing are fire hazards. The report shows the San Marcos Fire Department responded to over 30 calls for fires caused by unhoused persons over the last three years. And this map shows the three most recent incidents, which the report says happened in the the last two months. Also included in the report, these images, which the San Marcos City Council will be looking over Tuesday night as they vote on whether or not to locally enforce a ban on homeless encampments. The county's most recent point in time count says that San Marcos has around 35 people experiencing homelessness right now, and it's caused more than just fire hazards. The city says they're looking at environmental damage, public health issues because of human waste, and traffic obstructions that have impacted first responders. In this statement, the city says that their goal of this proposed ordinance is to protect the quality of life for all residents. They're also saying that along with enforcement, they would pair unsheltered people with outreach programs. But one North County homeless advocate we spoke to recently says that after the Supreme Court's ruling, these kind of bans won't solve the issue. People will move and will just continue to move around, which doesn't help solve homelessness. It actually prolongs homelessness, and makes it harder and more expensive. Uh, makes people actually experience more trauma and makes it harder to bring people back in the community. The city says that if the vote passes tonight, it will go to a second reading in the next regular city council meeting. And if it's approved there, then this homeless encampment ban will take effect 30 days after that. Reporting in San Marcos, I'm Danny Miskell, ABC 10 News.